Hi, this is second part of the abbreviation lesson. Let's go and quickly review what are abbreviations. Abbreviations are shortened form of a words. For example, months of the year we can abbreviate with a shorter form. You have to capitalize the abbreviation and put the period. We use abbreviation for titles like Dr, Mr, Miss and Mrs capital letter and period. We do not abbreviate the title Miss. We also use abbreviations for people's names when we use initials like Samuel Thomas Ruiz, S.T. Ruiz, M.J. Levin, P.J. Brown or Tommy Lee Jones, T.L. Jones, Sarah James Thomas, S.J. Thomas, Mary Jane Lewis, M.J. Lewis. Here we finished. Uh, mm, abbreviations for the months of the year. Have a look at them. We abbreviate all of the months except for May, June and July. Most of them they have three letters and then period except for September. September has four letters and period. We also abbreviate the days of the week. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Sunday, S-U-N, period. Monday, M-O-N, and period. Tuesday, T-U-E-S, period. Wednesday, W-E-D, period. Thursday, T-H-U-R-S, period. Friday, F-R-I, period. Saturday, S-A-T-N, period. This is the way we abbreviate the days of the week. Understand? Okay, now let's practice a little bit. How to make the abbreviations for the dates? Sunday, February 15th, 2020. We need abbreviation for Sunday, which will be S-U-N-N, period. Then you will copy comma. Then we need abbreviation for February. F-E-B period. Then 15. And then comma 2020. How it looks like? Like this. Again, Sunday we will write like this. Sun period. Now we will copy comma. February abbreviation is like this. Feb Period. Copy 15. Copy, comma, copy the day, the year. So, abbreviation for Sunday and February are like this. And the rest you need to just copy. Let's see. Monday, October 3rd, two, two, 2019. Abbreviation for Monday is M-O-N, period. October, abbreviation is O-C-T, right? That will be the date. Like this. Mon, period, then you will copy comma. October will be abbreviation OCT with period. Now you have no comma, you need to copy three first and then comma and then the year. This is how we write the dates with the abbreviations. Okay? Next one. Let's review. We use abbreviation for titles for initials of people's names, for the days of the week and months of the year. Good. Let's start working on page 400 in your book. Can you open up the book, please? Okay. We need to write each abbreviation and be sure to capitalize letters and use periods correctly. First one, number one, Mrs. W. Wenders. Where do we need to do and what? Do we have any capital letter missing or periods missing? I can't hear you. Yes, of course, the title. How do we write the title? What is missing in the title? The period. Everyone, you need to write the answer. Misses with the period. Next one. 
J. R. Burton. How do we write it correctly? Is this correct? Of course not. How do we fix it? Do we need capital letters? Do we need periods? Of course, because this is abbreviation for people's names initials. J must be capital, yes? And we need to put period after J. Then R must be capital, because it's a middle name, short letter for middle name, and followed by the period. What about Burton? It is capital already. Nothing to do in there. Number three. We have a date. Saturday, August 4. How do we write it correctly? Which, which where, where do we need to cap, put capital letters and period? Of course, Saturday must begins with capital S. Saturday, capital S. And how do you finish the abbreviation? With the period. Now you need to copy the comma. Understand? Now we need to abbreviate, correct this one, abbreviation for August. How do we correct it? Of course, August must begin with a capital A. Now this is abbreviation, A-U-G. How will you finish the abbreviation? With a period. Now we can copy for, there is no comma in there. So, don't forget, Saturday must be capitalized and finish with the period, because that's abbreviation. August begins with a capital letter, finish with the period. Copy four. Last one. Miss T.J. Matthews. Miss T.J. Matthews. Where do we need to put capital letters and period? Of course, Miss. The title. How do we write Miss? Capital letter. Miss. How do we finish the abbreviation? With the period. T is capital. Very good. But what should we finish after? What should we put after T? Period. J. Is it capital? No, it is not. We need to capitalize it. How we will finish? With the period. Period is already there. And Matthews, it's a family's name. Capital letter is already there. Very good. Now, some abbreviations can be used in sentences. Find the word that can be abbreviated in the sentence below and write the sentence with the abbreviation. Mr. Alexis got a pet bird when he moved to, the, to this country. Which word can be abbreviated? Mr. Alexis got a pet bird when he moved to this country. Did you find it? Did you? I'm going to give you the answer, so look for it quickly. Of course, Mr. We don't have to write word Mr. like this, Mr. Alexis. How do we write title Mr. Capital M and capital R. Capital R. And then... After the abbreviation, we need to put period. And then you can copy. Mr. Alexis got a pet bird when he moved to this country. No other words needs to be abbreviated. Good job. We will continue with the next PowerPoint.